Well, hello, hello, my beautiful wolf pack. Ow! Welcome, welcome. If you're new, please hit that subscribe, hit that bell button so you can get the notification. Also, I appreciate if you share. I've um, been doing um, a couple of readings this um, for this year of 2022 um, from decks where I are drawn, I'm drawn to, which um, they're calling out to me. I did a video for the angels and ancestors, so if you want to catch that quick video, today I'm doing the star seed um, cards. Okay, I'm gonna give you a quick message from that, and then I'm gonna follow it up with um, every you know from whichever deck comes next, you know. But I'm gonna try to do all of them for the year. Okay, so stay tuned for that. All right, hold on a second. All right, so let's clear the um, energy here. Let's clear any bad energy around you. very nice okay we're gonna take the cards from this portal in here star seeds let's see what messages and i asked that this reading excuse me well i asked that my beautiful guides please bless and protect the space i ask that you ensure only trustworthy answers come from the divine through these cards i ask that you let me see hear feel and know the messages you have for my wolf pack and I ask that this reading brings blessings to everyone involved. So it is, so be it. Okay, so let's do a quick message here for you guys from the star seed. Okay. From the star seed. Let's see what messages they have here for you. Okay, just give me one second, please. Okay, sorry about that. I just wanted to make sure I got the booklet because I'm doing all of the messages for you guys from the actual booklet. Okay, so every deck that you see in the videos that you um, you see me doing uh, um, doing a message, I'm gonna actually read from the booklet. Okay, so you could get the full message, and you could get you know I won't mislead anyone, or I won't say messages that you know that don't resonate with what it says in the booklet. Okay, hold on a second, please. Okay, here we go. All right, so now let's see what messages. I'm gonna take two cards because the readings are a little long, so. I want to make sure, well, let's see, because I said in my other video, my angels and ancestors, that I'm going to do two cards, and actually four of them came out. So, let's see what messages they have here for you, all right? So, whichever way it is, I'll read it for you guys on the book. Okay? So, let's see, beautiful guys, what messages you have here for my wolf pack from the Starseed Oracle cards. Let's see. Let's see what messages you have here for my wolf pack. What messages you have here for my wolf pack? There's two. All right, so I guess they threw two. Your bottom energy is perspective. None of this matters. Zoom out, common ground. Okay, then you have, hold on a second. Sorry about that. If you hear the little click, it's because I, I have to um, pause it certain calls of certain things that I have to call for whatever okay you have whale and orca elders share your song frequency sound divine deep okay then you got breath of the cosmos my will to thy will micromanaging the universe okay and I'm gonna get from the booklet what it says Okay, so let me read real quick the whale and orca elders, okay? And it tells you, which I have the booklet right here, share your song frequency of sounds divine deep. The whale of orca elders, the whale and orca elders are benevolent cosmic beings here to anchor a frequency of love onto the planet, to harmonize it with their song as they weave through the oceans they do so much more than any of us know their physical presence affects earth magnetic field and their harmonic calls us to wake up and remember our own soul song looking into the eyes of a whale is something you'll never forget whales see into you into your very being and in an instant you're changed forever you're changed forever 
they see beyond the physical, the woundings, the, the identity, the personality, the story. They see right into your soul. If you pull this card, you're being called to surrender to your deepest truth and share it with potency. To bow to who you truly are. The strength, your heart wide, wide enough to hold it all. To leave your fears, doubts, and baggage at the door. Excuse me. Sorry about that. I hate that I have to do that. Um, baggage. Okay, at the door. The, um, to question any part of you that doesn't feel good enough. The whale and orca elders want you to give others the privilege of seeing who you truly are. And for you to see the same in other beings. To drop your hang-ups and personality flaws. And get busy revealing the unique note your soul came here to sing. Allow the song that echoes in the four chambers of your heart to emanate in all four directions. Peel back the layers of suffering and pain and reveal to others your soul's true song and endeavor to see and endeavor to see the soul of all those you meet. Starseed inquiry is how are you being called to share your soul's unique song? Hmm. Start expressing things here, okay? Then you got breathe of the cosmos. Where my will to thy will, micromanaging the universe, right? When we are real when we rely on our own will, we're micro managing the universe and resisting the natural flow of life. We're not trusting the mysterious breath of life. We're rejecting the great cosmic intelligence and relying instead on our own personal strength. When we do this, we find ourselves attempting to bend things to our will. We spend our time forcing, pushing, and living from a space of trying to, of trying to, quote unquote. Everyone around us can feel it, and the universe can too. You're being called to stop micromanaging the universe and trust the breath of life. To surrender the greatness with that God has for you. To move from my will to thy will. When you surrender to the greatest will of life, you begin dancing with the rest of life. When you bow to the great mystery and say, please use me, please show me the way. Little by little, you find yourself living your most fulfilling, authentic life. When you surrender your personal will, when you relinquish control and release the way you think things should be and surrender to the greater, the greater will, you find yourself being led. You begin breathing the breath of life. Starsea activation. Place the card portal on your heart and whisper the following. Is going to be placed in your heart. I'm willing to stop relying on my own strength and personal agenda and instead surrender to the breath of life. Dear God, help me move from my will to thy will. Please lead me. Please show me the way. Oh, that is beautiful right there. That is a beautiful, beautiful message. So I'm going to give you the one for the bottom energy, which was the perspective. None of this matters. Zoom out, common ground. Take a step back and look at the bigger picture of your life. Step away from the blink, blinkered vision and reactivate, I'm sorry, reactive frame of mind. So blinkered vision and reactive frame of mind of me against them. Change your perspective. Shift your point of view and zoom out, 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 out. Again, breathe the cosmos. Mm -hmm. Breath of the cosmos. Mm -hmm. I'm just saying, we are but a speck of dust in the universe, yet we think everything revolves around us. We see the planet as our own and conquer, um, and setting ourselves up for our eventual extinction. We build fences and walls and create invisible borders. Mother Earth doesn't need us to survive, but we need her. 
It's time to wake up. A new perspective is urgently needed. We become so lost in our individual experiences that we don't realize the most of the things that keep us awake at night are actually distractions. We're wasting our precious time and resources fighting each other when we should be coming together to heal what's been severed. This moment is a breath. <laughs> it says it right there. <coughs> In the timeline of your life. This life is fleeting moment, is a fleeting moment in the tapestry of your soul's experience. Your soul's experience is a flash in the timeline of the known universe. And the known universe is a grain of sand in the unknown universe. Take a moment to see the bigger picture, to find common ground, to find deep compassion in your heart, to gain a greater perspective of humanity in this fleeting moment in the timeline of your soul existence in the timeline of all that is was and ever will be starseed soul inquiry how are you being called to change your perspective oh that's beautiful okay so i hope and i hope i hope this resonates with you or at least take these messages and pay attention to them and put them in your pocket for this year okay so I hope this, again, helps you out a lot or a little bit. So take care now, my beautiful Wolfpack. Love and light. Bye-bye.